Hello, hello, everyone. It is I, Bovine Gaming, here with this game. Here with Dark Souls 2. Just starting a new. Perhaps just showing you've you guys the full on part of it. Maybe in a dream, a murky, forgotten land. Place where souls may mend your ailing mind. You will lose everything. That's not very nice. Once branded the symbol of the curse, hey, an augur of darkness. Your past, your future, your very light. Dang. None will have meaning, and you won't even care. By then, you'll be something other than human. A thing that feeds on souls, a hollow. Long ago, in a walled-off land far to the north, she look like that, a great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? But one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without really knowing why. I'd rather not. I'd rather know why. to a flame. Your wings will burn in anguish. I don't have any, but... Time after time. Oh, the Dark Souls game, I know that. For that is your fate. The fate of the cursed. Fading souls. Cool. What we look like right now. Let's go. Mm. 
Gotta say, on PC, it's not, it's not that bad. I once had this game on a PC a couple of months back. It was like last, uh, last time I played, it was like last year. And bro, it was just so laggy. Like online, offline, anything. Um. Oh yeah. I can. I just type it in. Spelt bovine wrong. Bovine gaming. Burp. Closer look. Who do you think it's supposed to be? Think back deep into your past. Yes, it's an effigy of you. All right. Um. First, I'm gonna make myself look like a tomato. started off actually as a sorcerer but knight's also good mm. I normally put magic in with everything if I do if I put sorcerer I won't have to put in as much it's true I'll probably just go in as a quality build. By that, I'll probably want to, um... Maybe Swordsman. Start off with no health, though. I'll go for Knight. All 
people come here for the same reason? Who? who? To break the curse. Asked. You're no different, I should think. Get trolled. Hmm. Doesn't stand a chance. Well, you never know. <laughs> Go through the door and trot along to the kingdom. Mm, I want to skip this cutscene so bad. Hold on to your souls. What? They're all that keep you from going hollow. Who? Oh, I'll fool you no longer. You lose your souls. All of them. Over and over again. <laughs> All right. I have... Oh, M does that, okay. Whole bunch of PC commands, I don't know. I mean, whereas if you come up here, there's a human effigy. Um... Well, that's right, you don't start off with an Estus. Now, I'm not really planning on sinning, but... Um, if you kill this lady, you get six human effigies, and if you kill this lady, you get three. But, there is a, um, certain fat man that I want to go, um, destroy. Because if you saw something, there's a little pathway. I think, hmm, well, I'm gaming, what's through here? Ah, dinosaur tracks! <coughs> That was unexpected. There, <coughs> there is hippoclops. Guys, <laughs> look at that face. I do no damage. <laughs> First death of the playthrough to a giant hit though. Uh, how fun. I didn't even like the box car up there, anyways. Um, let's not look like an ugly person. I want to look like a tomato. Uh, we'll come back for him. And probably make that set. When I have a better weapon. Oh. To go right through here. So there's a little item. A rusted coin. Those help boost item discovery, I do believe. My uh, apologies for the coughing fit that I had. So, you know how the uh, you just have some of that random tingle in your throat and it just causes you to go. Bleh. It happens to us all. Soul of the Lost Undead. Those give you 200 souls. Mm. This is mostly the tutorial area. It doesn't have the boss. Two of them. Easy. This is what our backstab looks like. 
this is what a backstab looks like. Look at my tomato -ness. And if I can get one, I'll show you what a parry will cost. so far. 16 minutes in. That was just dirty. It's been a while, and I don't remember if I figure if I remember all the Estes locations. Shut up. Give me twinkling titanite, oh crimson water, come on, I'm not eating. Bruh. And as per walkthrough usual, I have to share where everything is, so I'm gonna go through here. Sometimes die trying to make the jump back because I just it just puts me off course. But I made it. And then there's a ladder, obviously. Comes up here. It shows you how to do a plunging attack. Yeah. Cracked Red Eye Orb to do some early game trolling. Mm, that's about it. There's a statue right there. And if you come right here... There's a morning star and a sacred shrine. Binoculars right there. Great for sorcerers. Now I said that I wasn't going to do sin, but what I meant by that is I'm going to do some trolling. Oh crap! I have to show dialogue. I don't wanna. I'm gonna go kill this man. Before that, I'm going to loot his house. Bro. 
Ha <laughs> Killing this man, you get his set. And it basically gives you free money. Now, this person has a whole bunch of dialogue, I'm just gonna mm. skip it. Is you guys it can look it up, or I can just show you it, I can just show it to you if I ever do another playthrough or not. Probably won't. I don't really plan on doing any co-op, so soul memory, yep. Oh well. This guy gives you a ring. His name's Crestfallen Salden, he's he, he's a depressed man. When put Cheap and unlocked. Covenant of the meek. I pretty much know how to get everything in this game. Let this Gesture. Now, you might think, Bovine Gaming, why are you gonna kill this man? I can either die a hundred times or kill him for a ring that gives me better physical protection. And I'm going to kill him. Yes, I have. I got him hinged to where I tried to parry the little air. ADP. Don't you try it. Get parried, nerd. Yeah, peace with me. Um, should I end it here? Yeah. Well, guys, I'll see you in the next episode. Ryan Gaming out.